All right, guys, welcome back to Milsom Direct. We're here to take a look at one of our, actually, our own products that we made, designed and manufactured right here in the USA. And this is something we definitely think you guys are going to enjoy. This is the first time anything like this has hit the market for Tipman markers. We designed it specifically for the A5 and the X7. How would you like this AR-15 shroud, or for that matter, any AR-15 shroud, to go on to your paintball Tipman A5, X7, or X7 Phenom marker? That would be great, right? Well, it's been done. So, we went out, and we designed a part very similar to this. This is the Tipman A5, X7, X7 Phenom standard barrel nut. Everyone's familiar with it. Push it in, quarter turn, threads in the back there until your barrel goes in. We took that, we created our own design, and voila, the Milson Direct AR MD Armalite Rifle Milson Direct Adapter. All right, this is very well done. We went to a company right here in Pennsylvania, AMM. They make military grade aircraft parts for the F-18 fighter jet and they built these for us. So the quality is very good. The, the aluminum used is very good. We put a primary o-ring to create the seal between the receiver and we have the inner o-ring for the inner bolt inside there as well. You can see that. And then it's military grade anodized, not commercial, military grade anodized. They hold up really well. We've tested a bunch of them. We sent them out to a bunch of different people to test and, and give us a review and feedback on them. Everyone loved them. Price point is fair. Take a look at that at the website. So we'll go into a little more detail on these, all right? So we have two models. We have the A5 and the X7, and I'll tell you the difference between the two shortly. The X7 also works for the Phenom, obviously. I'll show you guys how this works. So this is a AR-15 free float shroud barrel nut, okay? This would be one of your free float shrouds. Now, these are universal on your Air 15 platforms, okay? Which means they're universal on your A5 and X7 platforms now if you buy one of these. Thread this on. All right? That's where that shroud would thread in right there, okay? Now, your ARMD adapter threads right into there. And you can use an AR wrench to tighten this down to make it really tight, or a pair of pliers with a cloth, whatever you guys decide to do. All right, I'm going to take this off for purposes of showing you with the barrel inside. You can see we have a very nice inner diameter there to accommodate all barrels. We have yet to find one that doesn't fit. Uh, the hammer heads, the apex, they all fit in there. They're thicker in diameter than the standard tip and barrels are. And you'll see that when I put this in, you'll see the difference between the two. So the barrel threads right in. And it seats nice and snug. That inner o-ring makes a very nice tight seal. And you can see on the camera right there, it's perfect. There's no spacing between the barrel and the adapter. It lines up perfectly. All right, this is high quality stuff. We took a lot of time a lot of effort into making sure that these worked really well for you guys. So after you do that, you can put your free flow shroud on. Now, the thing is, guys, is the AR-15 shrouds are easy to come by, and they're not expensive. Anywhere from 20 to 100 bucks to buy some very nice looking AR-15 free flow shrouds. Anything with rails, Anything that's uh, like this, the smooth hand guards, the machine designs in the hand guards, the, your options are unlimited. It's going to open up a whole new world of Milsom paintball. The looks on your guns are going to be unlimited. And if you have an AR-15 and a loose shroud laying around your house, now you can take it and put it in your A5 and X7. And you don't have to buy an A5 specific part if you have an A5. And then another X7 specific part if you have an X7. You can take your A5 part swap it out to your X7, your handguard, and vice versa. So you can change the look of your loadouts as you go, which is great. I have my hand tightened, obviously, but you can tighten that down with the wrench. It holds on really well, especially when you mount the front post on the barrel. So there you can see with the barrel in it. You can see the spacing between the barrel and that inner diameter there of that hole. 
so that uh, the thicker barrels like the hammerheads and the apex will fit in there. Now the difference between this A5 and X7 is very slight. They are identical except for the X7 piece has an extended shaft. This part right here is extended. And the reason for that is because the A5s, when the original barrel nut fits in the frame, only comes to about here. When you put this in the X7, it comes to about here. So we had to extend the X7 model ARMDs out farther to allow for that room on around the receiver and still give your threads. There is a space between the threads, the end of the threads where the foregrip is going to stop, your handguard is going to stop, and the receiver. There's a space between them. So you can get your wrench in and do what you got to do. All right. Very well made and made right here in the USA. You can't beat that, guys. Now, the other thing we're going to talk about briefly, which a couple of people asked about, and we are in the process of working on, is what about non free float shrouds and adapters that use the delta ring assembly? Well, they will work on this as well. And this is a authentic Magpul shroud. Right from the factory. All right, two-piece handguard, and that's what we're talking about. The two-piece handguard into the delta ring. This is a real AR-15 delta ring. Okay, this will fit right into your ARMD adapter, and in turn, right into your Tibman A5 or X7, with the space you need to be able to pull that ring back and do what you got to do to release the grips if you really needed to. The only issue currently right now, and we are working on this for you guys, we'll be releasing it shortly, probably in the next month or two, we'll have a bunch of them made and we will be posting them for sale, is the front ring for your two-piece handguards. The inner diameter is smaller than that of a standard Tipman A5 paintball barrel, so it will not fit over there, okay? We are working on getting these made, recreated for us, with a wider diameter hole to allow you guys to use them in place with the ARMD adapter, ARMD adapter, onto two-piece handguards, okay? Your two-piece handguard will fit like this onto your painful marker, but it's going to have a little bit of play unless you have a front post mounted, which you may be able to get away with just that currently. But that ring is supposed to sit in here. Okay? That's what holds those two parts together. All right. We are working on getting this part ready for you guys as well. That'll be in the near future, but currently they do fit. We kept that in mind when we designed it to make sure that these would work as well. So your your options are unlimited in regards to two-piece handguards and free floats handguards that are out there. The price on free float handguards are inexpensive. They look really good. They're better quality than most other companies make for paintball stuff because they're military grade, they're lightweight, and they're not that expensive. And that's pretty much it, guys. You have our ARMD X7 and the ARMD A5. They're available currently on our store on eBay. We're going to be getting them from our website as well. And then they're also going to be coming to Amazon, too. Two-piece free float. Two-piece is going to be completed in the near future. If you want to take it now, you can probably get away with doing it now, too. We know you guys are really going to love this product. It's very well made. We built it for you guys. We want you guys to get out there and, and keep playing Scenario Ball. We appreciate all the time. Thanks for watching. And subscribe. Thanks.